Beer industry in Toledo is about to branch out. For the first time in more than four decades, Buckeye beer will be available in cans. 13 ABC's Tony Geftis explains how this bold move could be a big step for the local economy. With the push of a button, the very first Buckeye beer in a can tumbles to life for the first time in 41 years. And Buckeye beer has been in Toledo since 1838. So there's a lot of history there. Neil Kovacic is the general manager for Maumee Bay Brewing Company. He explains canned beer is coming back in vogue among local brewers. A study was done in microbreweries that start to can their beer on the average have an increase of about 35% in business. So people want cans, it's more convenient. Buckeye beer has been bottled in this facility across the street from the Oliver House since the late 90s. Today, the owners contracted a mobile canning company, coincidentally called Buckeye Canning. By the end of the day, Mommy Bay expects to have 750 cases of Buckeye beer in the can. And if all goes well, those at Mommy Bay Brewing Company expect to be canning another batch of Buckeye beer at the end of this month. If you're going to an Ohio State uh, tailgate party, I think it's a little easier to, to grab a six-pack of cans than it is a six-pack of bottles and have to deal with it. So right. we think there's a market for it. It's all part of a local beer business that's booming, rolling out the red cans to Ohio, Indiana, and even Michigan. In Toledo, Tony Geftis, 13 ABC Action News. And by the way, the bottles used for Buckeye beer come from Owens, Illinois. And the local distributor is True House of Munch, all here in Northwest Ohio. So Buckeye beer, a direct boost for other local companies as well.